This video will explain what a page layout is, how its dimensions are determined, and list some important attributes. What is the layout? Pages are created by adding areas, or containers, to them. The way you combine containers to create the page is called the layout. The layout is the basic structure of your page. After you create the page's layout, you can add content to the containers by adding widgets. Once you've done that, you'll be able to design each container separately and add animations and effects to it. Width and Height By default, pages are built from the top downwards and have a fixed width of 1,440 pixels. This is the standard width for all websites on a desktop view. Elementor allows you to set the width of the content within the page. The height of a page will be the same height as all the containers you use to build it. Containers have several flexibility properties, with a key one being that the container's height will be the same height as the content it holds. The widget height will affect the container's height, thus affecting the page's size. That said, for you to have better control over the layout, you can define containers with a minimum height. Under the minimum height setting, as long as the widgets have free space to grow into, they can expand without affecting the container. Once the free space is exhausted, the container height will change. Users will view your site from different devices, desktop, tablet, mobile, and so on. Horizontal scrolling isn't common, so the width of the page will be determined by the device's width. Based on that, the height will be adjusted to hold all the content accordingly. The width of the screen will affect the page's height, with a narrow screen making your page longer and a wide screen making your page shorter. This adjustment is called responsiveness. Responsiveness refers to the way content responds to the screen on which it's displayed meaning how your content automatically rearranges itself to fit different screen sizes. Container Characteristics By default, the layout is invisible to your site's users. They'll only be able to view it when we add content or properties to it. For example, we can add a background image to a certain area, but that background image won't be visible until we add height to our container. Since you can't add content where there's no page, adding a widget outside the layout also adds a container that holds the widget and adds that container to the layout. Now that you understand what a layout is, the next step will be to create your own.